I'm just about to bleed some oil through to this boiler um, that's the tanks run out of heating oil um, so the whole line has sucked in air and uh, it needs purged through I'm going to show you a quick way to do this got a tub got a dust sheet duster um, and an allen key for the bleed screw on the pump now let's get to it so it's a grant external oil boiler we've got here I'm just going to prop you up there so you can see exactly what I'm doing so make sure the oil's on at the tank make sure all isolation valves are open and that uh, the filters are clean then we'll take this screw out here Different oil pumps have got different screws. Some of them are on the side. But just take this out here. And the best way to do it is to attach your pressure gauge or hose on here. So you can hose it into your tub. I'm not going to do that, that this time. I'm going to do it into this tub like this. Um, let's get to it. I'm always ready to switch it off. Uh, if I need to So I've pressed the button I'm going to pull out the photo cell I'm going to cover the photo cell so it thinks that there's no light So that's how they work When it starts to spark, I'll release my finger I'll just keep the pump pumping. Now we're just bubbling away there. As you can see, we need to get rid of all the air until it's running pure oil into the tub or else it'll just keep on cutting out. This can take a bit of time, depending on how far the oil tank is from the burner. So once that's running uh, clear oil through, we'll uh, put the photo cell back in and then we'll get it fired up. And now, as you can hear, it's going and I've put the, the bleed screw back in photo cells back in, fired up fine because I let it run clear, beautiful.